Hey everybody, how's it going? Uh, this is the second devlog video that I'm uploading, the part one, the first actual looks at the game. So far, you can see the uh, active running scene that I have here. This is currently the only scene that I have working. I have a main menu scene that is being worked on, but not linked up yet. So far in this scene, you can see a couple things. We have numbers next to the main character on the left and the monster on the right. The green is the health, the red is the attack, and the gray is the armor. These are not final sprites. None of these are final sprites except for the slimes, possibly. The characters all have animations, but these are subject to change, mostly just there to experiment and see what I can get away with with different creatures and different movements and things. So I uh, learned a lot about animation and uh, got some cool game mechanics set up to kind of demonstrate what the game is going to be like more as time goes on. You have an energy value in your top left that indicates how many slime abilities you can use. Some slimes will use more or less energy. Uh, I have two or three slimes in the game right now. Uh, green, red, and gray. They each do different things. The green slime will heal you. Of course, there's no damage taken right now, so he does not heal anything. Uh, the gray slime will give you extra attack permanently, and the red slime will give you extra attack temporarily. So right now, if I turn combat on, you can see when I use the red slime, it buffs up the attack of the character for one move. And if I use the gray slime, it buffs it up three attack for the next move. There are some bugs. I still have, still working on the game, of course. The green slime heals your character whenever they take damage, but they cannot heal you over whatever your max health is. I'm going to color code all the numbers and make everything easier to see. So hopefully the game will be a lot more photogenic in the future. Uh, I have enemies that are entering the scene from the right side of the screen. Whenever the player kills an enemy, a new creature comes onto the scene from the right side. There is a system set up to control which characters are coming and adjust them. Unfortunately, I got three of the same character or creature roles, so they are random and hopefully in the future, I'll be able to add some cool variety, some cool rare enemies. The general idea of the game is you get your creatures, your slimes, I mean, you use their abilities to help enhance your character and keep them fighting from, uh, keep them fighting enemies. So far, you can merge slimes by dragging them on top of each other. There's no visual indicator yet, but it is a step in the right direction. It does keep track of how many times the slime has been merged. You can also swap slimes around. They keep all their stats, all their information, everything like that. Uh, if you press escape, there is a options menu in the works. You can save and exit. You can click continue. It brings you back to whatever round you were on. There's still some things like the enemies that are random still because I haven't added those to the save file, but the enemies are all going to change. None of them are in their final state. They don't even have sprites yet, most of them, because I want to work on those all at the same time. I don't want to have to make demo art for each monster. I want to be able to make one final art piece. So far, I'm really happy with how this is coming. Like, I didn't expect to get this much done in just a month and a half. It seems like most of what I need to work on now is going to be art, UI, and a few more game mechanics like the floors of the dungeon, the shop level ups, all the different slimes abilities. There's still a lot of work that needs to be done, but the game has come a long way since just the start of an idea. Um, let me know what you think of the idea so far. Let me know if you have any suggestions. I'm always open to it. Uh, of course, this game is pretty open-ended right now. This is the core gameplay, but nothing is set in stone. And 
if there's any great ideas i might consider using parts or all of the ideas so uh thanks for watching uh this is the devlog part one done i'll see you again in a couple weeks or a month